Hi guys, subscribe to my channel now so that you do not forget. Hit that bell icon and get notified of my further uploads. Lastly, feel free to comment. Show me some love by giving me a thumbs up at the end of the video. Hi guys, and welcome back to the channel. Well, this has been quite a year and we've reached the end of 2019 and we're going into 2020. Well, let's take this year in perspective and see what I've achieved in this last year. So remember last year, I said we should actually double this channel or try and double this channel. Well, I must say we've succeeded in doing that. So at least I'm feeling very proud and I want to thank you guys for helping me achieve this. What was the highlights of this last year? Well, last year we had 40 videos that was uploaded for 2018. 2019 we've uploaded 31 videos and there's a good reason for, for that which I'll get into a bit later. We were able to achieve 60 subscribers in 2018 and we were actually standing now on 135 subscribers. Thanks guys, thanks a lot. So you're probably wondering why am I giving you all these stats? Am I bragging? Of course I am! I work hard on these videos and I'm feeling quite proud for what I've actually achieved for a channel that's only like two years old. I'm very happy. Last year we were able to achieve a thousand views on the 40 videos that was uploaded. This year, for the 31 videos that I've uploaded, I've achieved 4196 views. That's awesome guys, thanks. Now, from all those videos, the ones that were really the highlights, that were standing out, were the Grimora talk that I did. I got 1385 views on that one, and more than 13 likes, so at least I did something right. So, um, hey, keep on making that Grimora tab. It is really, really good, and it really tastes awesome, and I think I want to make one now for this uh, festive season when Christmas comes. It's like it. I have to make it. The second video that I see that did very well was my overalling, my uh, how-to videos, playing mechanic. The overalling of my Corsa Utility Bucky, that actually got a combined view of like a thousand views on my two videos that was out. So uh, that tells me that people actually like to see the mechanical side of things, how I actually fix things, and also the baking, which I don't do a lot of because it's expensive to buy the ingredients for baking. Then also the timing and performance video that I brought out for my Corsa Bucky actually generated 1,102 views. So that's awesome. But those views has been generated over a period of time, over a few months. The video that did the best and my biggest highlight for this year was the Rage Expo. I was able to generate, I got 249 views in two days. On that video alone and for me that was awesome the biggest reason being that I actually got to meet Grant Hind so Grant if you're watching this video I'm sorry for being such an ass uh, you know when you get to meet a celebrity or when you meet someone that you actually like a lot you kind of have this wow big moment and you kind of blow it that was me I really sounded awful my introduction was terrible he probably thinks this guy's a weirdo, but hopefully next year if I meet you again and we talk, I'll be more chilled about it. And yeah, but it was awesome meeting you. Um, you're probably not even watching these videos anyway, but uh, I really enjoyed speaking to you and I actually got a lot of uh, reaction. Thanks for giving me the shout out anyway. So those were the highlights of the year. Now let's speak about some of the lowlights. The stuff that didn't go so well. The reasons why the videos went down. On the 1st of June, I lost my mother. So, since then, I just haven't been quite focused and right, you know, my head wasn't quite in the right place. So, trying to sort out all her stuff, sorting out the house and all that stuff, you know, it's a big story which if someone passes away. It took most of my time and I'm still not quite finished with everything yet. Uh, at, added on top of that, it was work related stuff, we had uh, extra courses that we had to do, which means extra overtime trying to cover the, the, the shifts that I was working, so 
in the little time that I was off in the last three months, I had to catch up on everything that was left in the house. Be it cleaning, dog gardening, whatever. Everything fell behind. So I had to fix all that. And I had to catch up on all that. So at this point in time, we're done with everything. Um, so hopefully I can focus more on what I really want to do. And that's make content for you guys. You know, keep you guys interested. That's what I really want to do. So what's new for the next year? Well, so far, as you can see behind me, we've got the new logo for CryptZone, uh, which I created somewhere in Windows 10 3D Paint. So hope you guys like my new logo. And also I made a new intro, which I have um, already started using in the last two videos. So this will be our new look and our new logo for the coming year. I hope you guys like it. I have three big projects so far in line that I really want to share with you guys. So please remember to subscribe, hit that bell icon so that you don't miss out. The projects will include um, overhauling a grandfather clock. I've got a grandfather clock that I really want to get up and starting again. So there's going to be a mission. Um, also I have a project uh, building something very big that I want to build. And I was thinking of getting a new tat. So I would actually like to share that with you and uh, maybe give you some tips and pointers, especially for the guys who are interested in getting tattoos and so on. I've been through it before, so I would like to show you my new one. I've, I'm working on a big one, basically a full shoulder one. So I think that'll be interesting to watch. So stay tuned for that. Let's see if we can uh, double the subscription again. Maybe we can reach 260 next year. We can only hope. To end of this video, I would just like to say thank you to all my loyal subscribers. Thank you to all the people that's watching my videos. Thank you to the people who's giving me thumbs ups and interacting with me. It really helps me keep motivated and helps me to produce stuff that I know that you guys would like to watch. I wish you all a Merry Christmas and a blessed and happy New Year. And I'll see you again then in January. And remember, this is the season of peace, love and unity and forgiveness. So try and love your neighbor, love your wife, love your kids. Enjoy the holidays. Remember what this, this time is for and who it's for. It's not just about the gifts. And relax. Enjoy your season. Enjoy your holidays. And then we'll be back next year. Till next time. Cheers.